Welcome to week number five for Terry. My name is Jody Bunting and this is our free weight loss course where our slimmers are going to lose a stone in six weeks. It's the end of week number four, Terry. How have you done? I think I've done all right, um, to be fair. I've not tracked it as much um, as I normally do. Uh, I think I lost it on was it Saturday. I didn't track it in Sunday. I didn't. Um, but obviously Sunday, I'll tell you my thing is why I didn't, I just didn't have time. Um, but through the week, I think I did all right. I managed to have two litres of water, I think, all the way till Thursday. And then it was like one litre. Because of being in Wick, I find it, I'm finding it quite difficult to sleep and drink. And <laughs> so I'm, I'm trying to keep it on it. Um, but, and I had the TikTok bottle as well. So I've, that did help. But um, I'm, I'm just trying to stick to obviously drinking the two litres like I should be. And what did the scale say? I lost another 2.5. So I'm literally Great. like bang on. So I'll be going into like the other stone bracket hopefully next week. So, yeah, you lost three pounds the week before you started, didn't you? Yeah. So because you've lost 11 pounds, you've actually lost a stone now, which is really fantastic. Yeah. And, and the other thing as well, next week, you're going to see a new number on the scales as well, aren't you? Yeah. And that's really motivating. So you're doing so well. I'm so impressed with you. Thank Are you. you starting to feel different now? I am, yeah. Like, um, big thing today, that's why my hair's all, like, curly and a bit thingy. Uh, <clears throat> I went to try my dress today to show my mum and everyone because I picked it. I think it was a month and a half ago but I went to go and collect it today and I actually fitted in it a lot better like before I squished squish my bum into it a bit and the zip was a bit tight now this time I just pulled it straight up zip went straight up Fantastic. and I'm actually loose on the lace so obviously I need it taken in now so obviously oh. if I keep going I'll get it taken in a bit more then yeah but you must have felt so amazing then in it when it was like that yeah I really did. I was like, I can't believe it because it was a big difference. Like with my clothes, I always buy baggy. So I never really noticed the such. Um, obviously, I buy leggings and stuff. So they're always the same, if you know what I mean. Yeah. Uh, but like, obviously, with the dress, I noticed it a whole lot more than I did in anything else, really. So yesterday was obviously Mother's Day. Were you spoiled? I was. I didn't get chocolates. I got flowers. But Great. we went Orton Towers with the kids for the day. Fantastic. Um, I, I literally spent the day how I would like it because I love Orton Towers. And I just so, wanted to obviously see the kids. So you ended up and doing I, lots of steps then as well, which is good about I Orton did a Tower. whole load of steps and walked everywhere. So we took the sky ride once and my, my partner and my two boys hated it. So we walked after that back back and, and everything. So, But I wanted to show them what it was like. Perfect. It was it was a really good day, really enjoyed it. But obviously I didn't track anything because I had obviously they weren't great stuff. Um I had two of the donuts yeah. at, at Orton Towers. And I had nachos, but I couldn't even eat them. I had like I think I had about five and then I just gave up. But they're not so nice. No, they had like they put all the sauce on it all together. And it kind of put me off a bit. It was all different sources, and the kind of, it was kind of mixed. And oh, was it? it just, yeah. So I didn't get that. And then I did. I'll be honest. I did order a strawberries with melted chocolate, but my son ate it. <laughs> From that little van, isn't it? On the way in and out, yeah. and it's all the yeah. I was leaving. I ordered that for myself, and he was like, "Mommy, can I have it?" So he had it. So oh, well yeah. done, Terry. Thanks. <laughs> Right, let's have a little look through your food diary. Um, yeah. So yesterday morning, uh, we've got a couple of biscuits on there. Uh, in the evening, a salad with ham. Was that yesterday morning? I can't remember. Sunday, yeah. Yeah, it was. I was that was what I had at work because I finished work early hours. I got back at seven, and then I'd like a two hour sleep and went to Horton Towers. <laughs> oh, I don't know how you do it. I really don't. Uh, Saturday. I remember then? I was like, where did that come from? And it was because I had a 
Right, Saturday were Slimming World chips with chicken and veg. Yeah. Uh, in the evening or throughout the night, should I say, you had a ham salad with beef. Yeah. Uh, Friday, salmon with Slimming World chips and some sweet chilli sauce. And then again, another salad. Thursday, uh, chocolate cookies. Yeah. Uh, the One of the HelloFresh meals, prawn. Yeah, I made it myself from the thing. Oh, well done. You see, this is why I like HelloFresh. It just gives you some inspiration, doesn't it? It does, yeah. I've kept all the recipe cards that I ordered before, so I just redo them. Perfect. And you had another salad. Uh, Wednesday, uh, Marmite on toast, I think that was. Yeah, and I used the, that unsalted butter, the block. Perfect. It tastes so good, doesn't it? It was actually quite nice, yeah. I thought yeah. this is going to be weird, but it was actually quite nice. It's amazing. I didn't tastes good. Buy meal bread because I didn't buy that, so I had white bread. <laughs> yeah, no problem. Um, for dinner, lots of veg, uh, chicken, bit of stuffing, gravy, bit of Yorkshire pudding. Mm. Lovely. Yeah. Don't worry. Uh, Tuesday. Uh, was was that an omelette with ham and mushroom? Yes, it was, yeah. And then the evening... Well, I uh, a sandwich, sandwich type thing. <laughs> it was weird, but it was nice. <laughs> and then in the evening, potatoes, ham and sweet chilli sauce. Yeah. Great. So a successful week, Terry. Yeah, I think I, I've, I'm like, you know, when you get in the hang of it, so Getting into I the swing of it. This is what we like to hear. <laughs> what is the plan for this week? Have you got any challenges? Uh, no, I've actually got a 5k inflatable run on Saturday. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Where? What are you doing? Who is it charity? <laughs> no, right. So the charity one's in July. So I'm doing the Pretty Muddy for Cancer Research. Great. So I'm doing that in July with my bridesmaids. But oh. one of my bridesmaids was like, shall we do this to get ready? And we've booked in at Donington. So we're doing just a 5K inflatable run thing. And there's 33 obstacles to go over. And I'm like, oh, what have I done? <laughs> so I'm going to be dead by the end of it. And you've got to do the obstacle. You've got to do it twice because it's like 2.5. So oh, so you have to go around it twice do once and i'm like give me about an hour i'll do it in a minute <laughs> it's going to be great exercise that's all i can say yeah it'll be really good oh i do have wedding cake tasting on friday <laughs> getting cupcakes so that is that is a bad one <laughs> no right just save your calories for it that's all because i want yeah, you to yeah. enjoy it it's important for you to obviously experience these things as you go i'll save my calories for it for sure yeah <laughs> that would be perfect Great. Right. Terry, what's your goal for next week? I, I think I'm on a 2.5 streak, so I'm going to stick with that. <laughs> OK. Sounds good to me. I think you can do it. And have you got Is any questions? No, no. I, I think I'm doing all right. I'm quite happy. Fabulous. Right. Thank you very much. That's it from me. Keep on going and I'll see you next week. I'll see you next week. Thank you. Great. Thank you, Terry. Thank you. Bye. Bye-bye.